Stop that, Pete. I'm playing myself yes. now, aren't I? Well, uh, <laughs> welcome, <laughs> welcome, everybody, to another episode of Anderson's TV <laughs> with myself, the captain. And me, Dennis Pete. And today, we are looking at a new invention from the clever people at Boss called a Pocket GT. Uh, it's this thing here. Um, and in a nutshell, <laughs> it, it has been designed by those clever people to use with um, a tablet or a phone or a computer or on its own, but I'll come to that separately, to enable you to play along and jam along to your favorite videos on YouTube. Yeah. So what is happening here? Uh, I hear you ask. Well, <laughs> yeah. the first thing that we're doing is we are using the app that comes with the Pocket GT to watch a YouTube video in. Here it is, Jam Along with Danish Pete, part of a series of videos that Pete did during lockdown to give you guys something to do. Mm. What happens then within the video, I can set markers that allow me to jump. As you can see, I've set a marker here going, Pete stops talking, Pete starts solo, <laughs> and our turn to solo. So if I was to start this video from you know back over here, you'll see as well. Uh, and yep, self yep. So I can for, just press uh, the, the next Pete stops talking. And it jumps straight away to that bit. I could go to Pete starts a solo and it jumps to that bit. And then I can jump to our turn to solo. These are all names that I've given it. So yeah. Bosch, here we go. Now it's our turn, right? So that's kind of handy and cool. And you can have as many different markers as you want on a video. Um, now, here's where it gets even cleverer. I bet you wish that you could do that to me and... What, Pete stops talking? Yeah. That's hopefully the extra mode in here, just press a button. Bluetooth, when um, I got my Bluetooth uh, yeah. on. Uh, the markers also, and here's a clever bit here, allow me to um, change a, the guitar effect that I've got. And the Pocket GT contains all the guitar effects that you would get in Boss's GT1 multi-effects unit. If you've um, not got that, but maybe you've got a Boss Waza Air headphones or something like that, it's kind of a similar vibe. Actually, there's more stuff in here than you get on Waza Air mm. headphones, but it's a similar kind of editing thing, and we can look at that in a minute as well. And the other super cool bit here, this AB function allows me to really, really quickly tap a start and a stop point for, say, a part of the, the riff that Pete was playing. So let's say, uh, I, I mean, I'll just play it for now. Let's say I want to hear from this bit to this bit. And now that is just going to go round and round and round to your heart's content. Cool. So um, now I, I, you'll see here the connection. I've got my iPad plugged in just because we, we ran out of charge. So this is full Bluetooth. You don't need the, you know, you don't need it um, plugged in. Uh, it also has a USB socket on the side, so if um, phones and tablets aren't your thing and you're just using ye old fashioned desktop computer, you can just USB up to that and it will do the same thing. Running on a battery, right? A lithium, lithium thingy battery inside there to charge it up, boom, off cool. it goes. It's, it's, re it's a rechargeable thing, is it? Yeah. How cool is that? Yeah, exactly. Um, so now, you can put it in your pocket, Lee. Uh, GT Lee. Um, <laughs> let's just quickly show you as well. So here's. I've got these three different markers here. Pete stops talking, Pete starts solo, our turn solo. It kind of doesn't really matter <laughs> what we've done those, but let's say I go into this marker. I can then choose uh, one of my presets. So these are all the different presets that are there. We've got Deluxe Crunch here. Oh, so these are the sounds in there? Yeah. yeah. If that's not my bag, I can go into the editor. I can change, again, the presets from here if what? I want to. Or And this is the bit where I was saying um, if you're a familiar with Waza Air or something, you've probably seen this kind of thing. Or I just go, no, actually what I want to do is I want to change the amp. So I've got different kinds of, you know, boogie lead and I can change. So wow. I, I don't that, want to go that, too great. much into the, the edit side of things because that's kind of, if you, as I said, that's the same as if you've got GT1 and it's very similar to if you've got Waza Air. If you, um, once you've stored your preset in here, you can even, uh, you don't even have to have a tablet attached to the Pocket GT. You can just use this as a standalone guitar in on one side, headphones in the other side and jam away. And there's a very simple editor on the top that sort of allows you to adjust things like gain, overdrive, modulation, delay, reverb, not quite to the depth that you can do it on the iPad, but enough to, you know, make some minor tweaks. That's super cool. Too. That's super cool. Yeah, so I'm kind of, 
I kind of think, you know, from as a teaching aid, so I, I can really, really begin to see people actually creating YouTube content now. For, aimed, for this thing? Yeah, absolutely. Say, look, because now here's where it gets super clever and potentially maybe Andertons will start to do this. Let's say a tutor or someone like Pete went, here's a video for you guys here to subscribe to. Um, here's the link to my video and you download this tiny little file uh, into your um, into the editor, into the, yep, the, the free yeah. app that comes with here. And not only will that put the video within, not will it embed the video within the screen, it'll also have all the marker points that the tutor wants to have, all of the preset tones Sounds. that the tutor yeah, wants you to have at the different slow points. Slow and overdrive, a tremolo sound. I mean, it's... And you can, then sh you can share that, right? You can download a file, you can download a link from YouTube, put it in, then do your own thing, and then you can share that with your friends. That's what we need to do. Yeah. We should, we're going to do that. It would I'm appear now. at the moment that it's um, only working with YouTube. So if you have other video um, players that, that you, know, you like to use, I, I don't believe right now that it's going to work with that. But I do believe that if you can download the video onto the device, as like an MP4 or something, yeah. it mm -hmm. will play from within the uh, from within the, the player. Um, and I I'll, noticed something. Sorry to interrupt there. Yeah. I noticed something. There were no commercials on there, Lee. There's no well, ads. I, I, I mean, I'm, that's just what we've been doing a, it here. Yeah, it's the proper YouTube API, so it's like an officially YouTube endorsed uh, app. Which is and but yeah, it does appear saying. to let you play the YouTube video with no adverts in it. I'm sure as soon as YouTube catch on to that, they'll work out a but, way of, oh, of putting like more adverts in. It's like paying for it. YouTube Premium, isn't it? Yeah, I guess to in a way. A um, couple of other features that you'll see at the bottom: your librarian and Tone Central. I mean, Boss are big into you know tone sharing. So if you want to go and jump on, see what other uh, presets people have created or buy presets that artists have created, you can do. Um, it's I mean, super duper clever, man. It's pretty clever. Uh, you did. I tell you what, I didn't show you. Can you of import? Course, can you show us to import a thing from YouTube? Can you go in, for instance, just to take a video we've done? I totally can. At Let's the moment, see how it does. I've got I'll two that. videos that are sort of linked to here. There's a there's the Pocket GT tutorial by the wonderful Alex Hutchins, and there's that jam video with Pete. Yeah. But if I basically just go, I open YouTube. I uh, here here are all the lockdown videos that Pete did. Um, I don't even have to open the video. I've got these three little dots on the side. Press share. Uh, it will come up. I need to share to more. And one of the more things will be my Pocket GT. Ha! Bish, bash, bosh, post. Thank you very much. What? Uh, there I it can opens call up the it. Avenue. What did we call it? Was it jam number five? I think it was, wasn't it? I it's, can't remember, yeah, it's fine. What, whatever what jam number five. Oh, jamboree five. Oh, that's even better. <laughs> it's, I, it's actually got spell check in here. So have fun with that. <laughs> jamboree. Um, so there is number five. Obviously, there's no markers or presets as part of that video. Because, so now you can do your um, thing and you can share that once you've done your sound and your markers and everything. Thing, you can then share that with your mates. Absolutely. Right, mate. Yeah, so that would be the idea, I well, guess, it. is the tutor would now go in, add the markers, um, create their own presets, and then share that file to other Pocket GT users. And can I just point out as well, this is a really cool thing because you could potentially go in. I know all the Anderson's Jam tracks are on YouTube uh, because of the way it's distributed. They put it on, on YouTube as a video, which you can then go and find as well. Oh, you mean the, it, the, yeah, the actual backing the tracks? The actual backing did. tracks, because ah. the way that it's been distributed uh, from the distribution company is that they now... They will now put them up as a video, but all you see is just the, you know the, the just a picture. It's just a, a picture, picture yeah. but the, but the, but the actual track is there, mm. so they, that you can do that as well. Put it on here and then jam away to your heart's content. Well, so I mean, I don't know if there's anything else I didn't mention. It's ro probably reasonably obvious. You've got a, a set of transport controls on Pocket GT. So if you wanted the iPad kind of over there and it was out of reach, you can press your play button oh. on here and away it goes. Hey everyone, welcome back hey everyone. to Anderson's. This is the best feature ever! <laughs> listen, listen, listen. You can. TV, my name is Pete and. Shut up, Pete. <laughs> um, and you of can course, mute we've me got. As well. uh, yeah, we've got um, fast forward and rewind. And just like hitting the fast forward button on uh, YouTube does, if you double tap the fast forward, it jumps forward 10 do seconds. It, do it's it, kinda do cool. it, do it. No, I'm not doing it. Do it! Um, there is a center canceller switch on there. Now that is 
if you're perhaps you've got a video um, you want to jam along with an actual uh, track and somebody's noodling with a guitar solo over the over the top you can hit this center cancel thing and it's a you know it's a little bit of a um, sledgehammer way of doing it. it just it just drops a big sweep out of the EQ curve where the guitar solo typically would be. Ah, okay, um, yeah, I see, okay, I see, kind I see, of yeah. Every, and takes that's, out everything else there as well, but it's, but that's you know, fine. it that's kind cool. of works. That's cool. Auxiliary input, so if you want to go super old school and just run uh, a backing track into here via this old fashioned thing called a cable, you actually can. <laughs> um, you're listening to this, by the way, with this uh, lead here. So the gold one is what Pete's guitar is plugged in with. And the, this lead here is just running into our computer interface. So you're just, you're not hearing a guitar amp or anything. It is just you're everything. You're just come. hearing this. Dude, this is really, really cool. I mean, I, I could see people spending hours and hours and hours and hours on this because it's just mm. so intuitive and easy to use. Yeah, I think the sounds are really, really good. And if you're liking the sounds, but going, I don't know if I really want to do this whole video thing, the basic engine in here is is the boss gt1 yeah. which is it's like with which is their sort of entry level little multi effects um, got a, a volume as well and three 100, 150 quid bosh so anyway so pop gt before we will will i'll set some other markers up i'll tell you what i'll do for this final one i'll create some markers where every 30 seconds or every 20 seconds it changes the guitar amp sound or something so you can see as pete plays out how it changes the sounds as it goes through the markers um, but there's nothing left to tell you really other than these are 220 quid um, available now. Um, links below. Yeah, links below. Nice to meet you, Marcus. Nice to meet you too. Marcus, was that? Anyway. I thought he kept saying Marcus. Oh, Marcus. 